Absolutely fantastic. The response from our customers and dogs has been amazing. I'm just overwhelmed with the response from our customers. During my visit to the Dog Friendly Cafe, I asked Paul, the owner, when did the idea come about to open this cafe in the city of Carlisle? Originally, we, Susie came to us after our house was flooded and we had a new home but no one to make it into a home, so we got Susie. And then our landlord, Paul Fox, wanted uh, a cafe down there. He came to us and said, Paul, will you open a cafe down next to my furniture shop? And I said, yeah, no problem, but I think we'll have to go with the dog theme because it's all the rage and down here we're near the park. And we've got loads of space for dogs to sit down and it's just the perfect environment to be here. When we think of dog-friendly cafes, we think that they're in more of the bigger cities such as London and Manchester. Why is it important that Carlisle has its own dog-friendly cafe? After we got Susie, we found that there wasn't many places we could take her to go and eat. We were left outside in the cold. So we wanted to give people the opportunity to come out and enjoy time with their dog and their family and eat some nice cake, food and just socialise. This cafe is very much on helping the environment and Paul had an important message that he wanted to say during my visit. The theme is dog friendly but we also went down the upcycled reuse use. We've got pitch pine uh, front of our counter, our kitchen was uh, reused so that we weren't damaging the environment making new products. We've got donations of lamps from local electrical companies. All the pictures have come from house clearances and the like. Our furniture's upcycled, and that goes with the theme of corporation road businesses where they're upcycling, painting furniture. We've got old teacups and saucers and teapots at one of the shops, and reused furniture at Foxy's. And upstairs, we've got Quirky Corner and Lorna doing stuff as well. So it's a great place for people to come and have a little browse and get a cup of tea, coffee, and one of our amazing scones or Victoria sandwich cakes. This new cafe in the city of Carlisle is really impressive. And being a dog owner of myself, I'm sure I'll be taking my two dogs to visit it very, very soon. Benjamin Johnstone, that's TV.